let me just get a bit of inspiration here. Men, today we leave. Today we leave our camp. We ride on horseback, on mule, on camel, on dog. And whatever animal we should find along the way, we ride north into battle against the scallywags, against the fools, against the piss witches, and the wizards and the elves. We ride north with all hope of victory. But just know that although we may hope and pray for our blessing on the battlefield, we may all fall. We may all fall. And as many pastries as we bake, they may bake several more. But this is no ordinary bake-off. This battle should be the greatest bake-off this land has ever seen. And this dragon that we have been chasing for several years with the crumpets may not arrive. This all may have been for... Uh, this all may have been for nothing. Who goes there? It is I. Mr. Wilson. What is your first name, Mr. Wilson? I'm known as God. God Wilson. God Wilson? Yes, son of Lemon. Son of Lemon? Your father was Lemon? This, the man who slayed the beast of the, with several torsos and baked fifty pies in one minute. Your father was Lennon himself. The stuff of legend, your father. No, that was my mother. Your mother was a fine man. She wasn't a man. She was a no. Anyway. Listen. <laughs> what brings you to these parts? We're about to head into battle. I am simply passing by, sir. Passing by? You wish to head south down to the Kensington Plains? You know the you know what lies in the Kensington Plains. I I, though I do know what lies in the Kensington Plains, I fear no marshmallow, nor orange, for I am on my way to visit my mother Lemon, for she is on her deathbed. Lemon is on his deathbed. Well, how long does he have left? Well, she has... The doctor's giving her, given her a few days to live. Well, then there's no time. It'll take you about a week to get there. Wherever you're going, I don't know where you're going, but I'm guessing it's going to take a fucking week. There's no point. There's no, absolutely no point for you to go and visit Lemon before he dies. Will you join us, God Wilson? Will you not join us in battle? Let me smoke this cigarette. Why would I join you in battle when I can fight against you? Fight against us? 
What sort of travesty is this? What sort of nonsense am I hearing from you, Mr. Gordon Wilson, fighting against us? You've called my mother a man several times now. She's this gender... This sexism amongst our time in the 1300s has plagued her, and plagued her entire life. I only fight for my mother, who was a fine woman. She slayed the beast with several torsos. She baked fifty pies in one minute. And history has remembered her as a man. And you, sir, are standing against my battle for vengeance upon that. Well then. Lads, take him down. Take him down with several pies. Bake, I, I wish, I want you to bake me several orange pies with lemon dressing, pecans on top. Don't stinge on the flour because that's the best bit. <laughs> and also throw in a couple of croissants. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs> oh fuck, he's frozen me. He must be a marshman. Oh god. I'm I'm literally just frozen still now. There's nothing I can do. I'm fucked. He's got us. He's going to kill us all. <laughs> Would you just look at my hideous face? It's frozen still. <laughs> Yes, I did freeze you, and, and now you cannot bake any pastries, you can only bake, to, you can only bake your face, <laughs> which is, what? <laughs> now I shall be the victor, and I shall steal all of your belongings, and travel to see my mother. That got really weird.